hi guys happy new year and welcome to another episode of my vlog on today's video we're going to be doing a lot of relaxation no more stress walking hiking or anything like that um today's video i will be showing you the city of kotonu but first we're going to just watch this football match and have a few drinks and then head out <laughs> As you may know by now, there are lots of French-speaking people in Cotonou for holidays. There are lots of people from France and then also people from Morocco who came to visit were also here. Keep in mind that Moroccans speak Arabic and they also speak French. So that's why it is extremely convenient to travel to a French-speaking West African country like Benin Republic since they do not understand the English language. I almost forgot to mention that the code bar, which was the place we visited for drinks, is usually strictly by invitation. You can't just waltz into the place. It's actually very difficult to just get in like that. And there are usually thorough checks at the entrance. I think at that point, I noticed that there was also a very strict dressing code. Well, I think that's why it's called the code bar. I'm just doing this video because this is like one of the biggest monuments in the whole of um, um, Benin Republic and it stands right here called the Amazon. I think it was done to honor women. Let's go. Yeah. go, go. Yes, this right here is Africa's longest graffiti mural in Kutunu Bene Republic. You should know that this wall is over 940 meters long. That's almost oh, 940 meters. That's almost a kilometer long. And it was really interesting to look at. You could tell that this was just like an embodiment of the West African culture and then the future, things to look forward to i for one if you haven't watched my previous videos you definitely should and you would know that west africa has so so much in common and the culture of west africa was thoroughly depicted on these walls my best part of this was the fact that they used a lot of dopamine colors while you're passing here you're already feeling good imagine coming out from the airport and you're already feeling good about Benin republic as you're going towards the city this was too too beautiful whoever did this or the team that put this together i'd say for one that they were very talented and very good at what they do okay, 
this was my third day in Benin Republic and of course you guys know I would want to try some more street food so here we had something that looked like beans and some rice and some fish as well unfortunately I was too hungry I forgot to do a video don't forget to like share and subscribe of course I hope you enjoyed this because I spent hours creating it see you guys in my next video bye to myself what a wonderful